Great. Um, <laughs> Red Rad Man. Um, first of all, don't worry about my voice. <laughs> it's not the recording. It's actually my bloody voice. I seem to have picked up some sort of bloody cold. And, uh, well, I'll probably have to put subtitles. Well, anyway, that's where we're going. I'll just mark that. And we're going to see you there. Okay, there's a bit of a mist laying on the floor. We'll probably have to wait for it to draw in again. Um, as you can see, <laughs> or not see. <laughs> so we're going to land and uh, have a quick look around first. So we not land. Oh, get off, land. We'll have a land and um, wait for it to draw. So, you know, that's what we're going to do. Okay, so there's one wing. <laughs> one wing. When I was here earlier, because I have to check these things exist before I come back again, there was two wings <laughs> and more legs. I remember more legs. I'm sure I remember more legs. After all, it's supposed to be like a wasp, so you know. It's got the yellow and black stripes. Just quicker, uh, I'll just show you from the outside. <laughs> Let's have a quick look. Okay, so there's the two eyeballs. As you can tell, it's like a wasp. Um, I don't know if you can just about make me out over there. I've just been that tree. Uh, it's coming into view now. It's a big bee. A big wasp. Um, the USS Vesper, I suppose. <laughs> okay. Okay, that. Oh, it's just out of rain. Um, some thunderstorms here. So what we do is we'll take a look inside while it's actually uh, stormy. There's the power. There's the thing. There's the thing. But right, it's getting here. Okay, we zin. <laughs> it's not much inside. It's just a uh, cuboid internal on the internal. But he's got a fire. He's obviously done. <laughs> he's obviously built his quicksilver up, and he got fire. I think somebody who can actually build them. But, um, you know. It doesn't seem to affect anything. It's just, you know, pretty. So, uh, there's nothing particularly in here though, so it's just an empty big shell. A <laughs> shell for a wasp. So, as you can see, uh, I can't see any other doors in or out, or through, around, over, between, any other way in. Nothing. So, no. All we got is this little cuboid section. And it still says it's stormy out there. So we'll have a quick look again. Yeah, look, the storm. Every, every time it goes over a certain height, the storm comes in. <laughs> oh, I missed the bloody stairs. Oh, great. Where's the stairs? Well, we go in here. Right, so we got a portal. We seem to have another teleport there. Why is there another teleport? I don't know. Will it let me, will it let me get in there? What? How's that? There's a teleport, but there's a teleport. It's just activating the teleport, not a short range. I'm just trying to see if I can activate this bloody thing. <laughs> he doesn't seem to want to. Um, so I'm not sure what the point of that is. I can't get to it. Um, uh, I wonder if it's just to make the blue look different. I'm not sure it goes anywhere. I can't see a teleport line. Like you can on these. That's going down, see? the ground but then there is one there but it's maybe the power line mm. it's probably just to affect that blue coloring I it looks weird okay anyway let's get outside we'll have a quick look around outside it's more pretty um, so here's the power Here's the base computer, so you can see, 
Red Rad Man. Oh, I'm stuck in it. <laughs> He's hiding the cables. I've just seen the cable hider. So much power you're producing, man. Ah, uh, the grid. I'm not sure whether it's doing one. There's no batteries, so... That's it. 585 used. Only f available, I meant to say, not used. 51k. So, yeah, 146 each. There's some of those animals there. Right, we gotta have a look at this. So there was more legs last time I was here. Definitely more legs, because they're supposed to have six. <laughs> hmm. Let's see if we can get up there a second. When my power pack's gonna last. Okay, what's on the end of here? That's supposed to be the sting. <laughs> That's the sting, obviously. Oh god, you can't fly straight. Uh, I, I don't know why. Okay, so it's obviously some... I don't know where he's lost his other wing as well. <laughs> so he's a bit disabled, this beastie. It looks like I'm drawing everything in, which is a bit weird, but you know, these things come and get us. And here's the other cone. As you can see, it's empty. Let's, let's give it a structure. It's weird. It's giving it a structure. We can see outside. Yeah, but it's just a shell, basically. What's that? Oh, that's the cubes are just sticking through. Okay, it's really glitched them in, I think. So we can get out of here. <laughs> Maybe not. Oh, sorry, birdie. Right, so the wings were double that. They were doubled, double. Um, so he's, he's done okay, I mean, it looks like a wasp from further away, especially when it had all six legs hanging there. <laughs> he's a kind of legless wasp at the moment. As you can see, so there's, he's put the things as his eyeballs, which is neat, good use of, and two, obviously. So it's just a short thing. We're going down now. So there he is. I like it. Looks better from afar. We'll take a quick look from afar again. It looks better, that one. And then um, we will have to go. We'll have to leave it. It's a short visit today. Uh, there it is. Let's come out of there in a minute. Wait for that. Drop. Quick picture. Oh, he's lost his. <laughs> he lost his bloody bits now. See how he's connected them. Look at that. How did you, these glitches are great. I just don't know how they do it. However, we gotta go. I can say short version for a maimed <laughs> a maimed wasp. Okay. See you later. I've got to give my voice a rest anyway. <laughs>